Order. I trust you've made yourself comfortable. This is Elena. She's... I am Queen Enora's handmaiden. She sent me here to ask for your help. Or perhaps the young lady prefers to speak for herself. I am here for Loghain's daughter, not for Loghain. Their interests are not so similar as they once were. The Queen, she is in a difficult position. She loved her husband, no? And trusted her father to protect him. When he returns with no king and only dark rumors, what is she to think? She worries, no? But when she tries to speak with him, he does not answer. He tells her not to trouble herself. My queen suspects she cannot trust her father. And Logan, he is very subtle, no? But when and how, he is privy to all the secrets and not so subtle. So she goes to how? A visit from the queen to the new Isle of Denrum is only a matter of courtesy. And she demands answers. They now know she is a threat to her father's power. I think her life is in danger. I heard how say she would be a greater ally dead than alive, especially if her death could be blamed on Arl Eamon. Because you do not want Loghain ruling Ferelden, and if Nora can speak at the lands meet, her voice would sway many nobles. We may have no choice but to trust Anora. The Queen is well loved. If Loghain succeeded in pinning her death on me, I'm not sure that's a risk we can afford to take. I have some uniforms. I'll how hire so many new guards every day. A few more will not cause much stir. I will show you to the servants and friends. We must slip in and out with my queen before anyone is the wiser. I will go ahead to house estate. Meet me there as soon as you can. Glad you decided to help. With the Nora's knowledge, we have a far better chance against Loki. From Alina's story, he turned against her first. If he truly intends to sacrifice her, I think it will be strong motivation to break the parental bonds. In any event, I would far rather have the opportunity to ask such things of her than simply hear about her murder. If Honora speaks out against Loghain, hers would indeed be one of the most powerful voices of the Landsmeet. She's obviously more than a maidservant, but I imagine it's useful for Anora to have a trusted attendant who can move more freely than she herself, and consider what aid she and the Queen might be to us. If Anora has truly turned against her father, she becomes the one thing we lack. Someone with a true understanding of Loghain's plans and allies. With her guidance, we can form a far more successful strategy against him. No more easily than without you there. There will be none to see it, save those who are already loyal to Loghain. And given your reputation, Warden, I think Loghain knows it's safer to carry out his plots far from where you can disrupt them. She and Kaelin were promised as children and practically raised together. She was a smart child, knew how to listen, and how to blink those big blue eyes and get anything she wanted. Her mother's looks, her father's brains, and the best tutoring Merrick's money could buy. It's a potent combination. As you like. My palace is your palace. ...side of the house. We must slip past this cloud to reach it. We will have to be very careful. Al how is inside. Do you not see the angry workmen there? I think it will be some time before even Rand and Hau can use this front door, no? I will be right behind you. I can distract the guards, but you must move quickly. More guards patrol every hour. If they find these two missing, they will know... How do you say? Something is amiss. Hurry! My lady does not have much time.
I will go distract the guards. These two know who is allowed to come and go. They will not be fooled. But the uniform should work on most of those inside. I will lure them into the courtyard. Wait in the bushes. Come! I saw something! A better fountain! I think it was a dark spawn. Dark spawn? They will drag us all underground to be eaten! Should we call for help? Did you fall off a cart full of stupid? Call for help? So they can see us act like scared little girls because of some knife-eared wench? They will eat us all alive! Please get help! If there is something out there and we don't sound the alarm, we'll look worse than scared. And dress these holy knickers. Fine, we'll check the courtyard, if it'll keep you from wetting yourself. But there's nothing there. Thank you. Oh! It was over here! Quickly! Ah, oh, it took me forever to be rid of those two. You must be careful now. The servants, they will not look closely at anyone in uniform. All guards are alike to a cook, no? But you should not draw attention to yourself. Most of the guards are new. They will not know you for a stranger at a glance. It is best to keep your distance from all of them and try to blend in. She's in a guest room, off the main hall. Andra, stay guide us. The Grey Warden is here, my lady. Thank the Maker. I would greet you properly, but I'm afraid we've had a setback. My host was not content with leaving me under heavy guard. He sealed the door by magic. We must get her out of there. Don't panic, Erlina. Find the mage who cast the spell. He'll most likely be at Hal's side. Well, if he didn't know you were here, he soon will. Please, Walden, I beg you, do not leave my queen here. Free me, and I promise you my aid in the land meet. We do not have much time. We must go before the guards discover us. Karen Howe will probably be in his rooms. They're at the end of the hall, on the left. Look, you didn't say nothing. Wait, who are you? You're not on my watch! Call the watch! We've got an... What? Who goes there? I thank you for creating such distraction, stranger. I have been waiting days for the opportunity. Do you think you could... Alistair? Is that you? Who... Wait. I do know you. You were at my joining. He's one of us. A warden for Morlay. Jada, I think. Or was it Monsama? I'm afraid I don't remember your name. Amri Orden, senior warden of Jada. But born and bred in Hyever. And glad to be home. Because I wasn't there. I was sent from Orlais when we received no word from King Kaelin. The king had invited all the wardens of Orlais and their support troops to join him. Then nothing. With an offer of hospitality and a poisoned chalice, I was fool enough to think Loghain didn't yet know who I was. I saw him going to the dungeons. He may still be there. I wouldn't be much use to you in my current condition. And if you'll pardon me, I have a sudden desire to breathe some free air. I will seek you out later, after I find a good physician. And good luck, sister. Was this supposed to be a lesson? Did my father think it funny to leave me for so long before sending you? Then my... my father didn't send you? I am Oswin, son of Ban Sigurd. 
of the Dragon's Peak Bannon. If you aren't one of our soldiers, pray tell me, who should I be thanking for my rescue? Then I have no question about why you would come, Warden. For it is your men who have suffered the most here. You have my heartfelt gratitude. And, I assume, the gratitude of the entire Dragon's Peak Bannon. If my father sent no one after me, I can only assume that he does not yet know the true colors of the snakes he is allied with. But if you talk to him, I'm certain he would offer you any reward you might ask. One soldier returning from Ostagar was my wet nurse's son. We have been friends since birth. He told me his unit was ordered to turn their backs on Kaelin at Ostagar, before the Darkspawn overwhelmed him. The next day he disappeared. When I went to search for him, I accepted a drink from a stranger and ended up here. Then there is a Landsmeet after all. How said the Isle of Rickliffe was dead and the Landsmeet called off? I swear, if there be any forum to speak out against Loghain, my father will be there. Now, please, I must try to get to him. I cannot see the last of this place too soon. What month is it? Are you some enemy of our Illyrians? Please, I feel like I've spent half my life down here. Dead. Then, who's ruling? His son, Vaughn, he struck me down and I woke up here. People were so angry, they, they were thinking of petitioning the king. There have been many changes since they caught me. I need to find out what happened. I need to get home, or flee the city. I, I thank you for your aid, stranger. I wish I had more than gratitude to offer. To retreat. The horn sounded and we turned, and then the screams. We rode and they screamed and screamed and. <sighs> Mother, can you smell the blood? They said it was only Darkspawn. But we ate them too. They died. And we left them in the swamp. The witch. The witch! He's obviously mad. I don't think you'll get anything more out of him. Safe? Is there a safe? Perhaps next door? Well, the Grey Warden. I must say I'm surprised Eamon would condone you invading my castle and murdering my men. Is he losing faith in the persuasive powers of his land's meat? <laughs> the traitorous bitch has you under her thumb. Anora does love games. I'm surprised she'd play with the likes of you. You should have left when you had the chance, Warden slunk off to the Anderfels to hide with the rest of your kind. This landsmeet is a farce. Loghain will triumph, and you will die. Make a spit on you. I deserved more. Draste, Bride of the Maker, have mercy on me. Alstana, is that you, little sister? No, I, I don't know you, do I? Are you real? I... Where am I? I... I'm Erminric, Knight Lieutenant of the Denerim Chantry. You... aren't one of the Tern's men? He sounds like he's in Lyrium withdrawal. He's got all the signs, confusion, weepiness. He probably doesn't even know what he's saying. If the Grand Cleric knew he were in here, she'd be spitting hot coals. Nobles don't have authority over Templars. I... I failed in my duties, Maker. Forgive me. I failed, and there's no telling what he's done. 
the Malefica. He had turned blood magic upon Templars and Circle Mages to escape from his tower. Near Redcliffe, I cornered him, but the Thames men took him from me and brought me here. Yes, he destroyed his phylactery. We were spread out, trying to find him. I was alone. I... You are real, aren't you? My dreams are so strange now. Please, if you're not a dream, help me. Give this ring to my sister, Alstan. Tell her. Tell her I'm sorry. Please, ask her to pray for me. Who's there? Stay away. You can't do this to me. I'll have you all flayed. I'm the Arl of Denerim. I'm Vaughn Kendall's, heir to the Arling of Denerim. It's true. Too many of our troops were lost at Ostagar. When the riots started, Howe came with men to reinforce the garrison here. Or that's what he claimed. As soon as I let him into the palace, he threw me in here. One more victim of the Elven uprising, he said. Let me out of here. I'll do anything. How should I know? They're prickly and take offense at anything. It's only their laziness that keeps them from being trouble most of the time. What? You fat whore! Come back here! Let me out! My thanks. Because there are two sorts of people in this house. Those loyal to Howe, and those loyal to me. If Howe's people find me, I'll be killed. And my people will insist on escorting me back to the palace, where my father may also have me killed. Warden, in the name of the Regent, I am placing you under arrest for the murder of Rendon Howe and his men-at-arms. Surrender, and you may be shown mercy. Bring them down! Loghain wants the Warden, dead or alive. 